Man, Jesse's looking a little tired under the eyes. Well, it's the look. That's the 2020 look. Is it? Yep. Gucci it's... janitor's outfit. I was gonna uh, say, is this your is, is this your quarantine look? Prada bags under your eyes. Oh my god, so far to go. Yeah, no, yeah. fuck this. We're just I'm gonna get us there. Louis Vuitton uh, We won't restart the episode uh, here. FBC gun. That's the fit. That's so the that's the twenty twenty. Wait, hold up. What? Hold the fucking phone. I'm hold I well, I it's gone now, Tim. I broke oh, it. Oh up there. Okay, okay. So somewhere along this cave system, I'll be able to come back around and up there and across and find out whatever the fuck is over there. Uh-huh. You see? Yeah. But that's going to be after we actually accomplish the cave bleed area. And then go all the way around? Right. How would we get up there? Uh, it looks like... Oh, we just go straight and then follow around to the right? Right, exactly. Okay. Coming over this bridge here will take us through another room, which will... Probably connect this little gap that's right below my red yep. arrow, and then we'll be able to go over there. Cool. At least that's my assumption. Mm -hmm. We'll see what actually happens. This game has a habit of uh, taking what you expect and fucking it right up. That's art, man. Yeah. Gotta do it. Yeah. Is that a what? is that a Jawa? Nope. Okay. I definitely was wondering what kind of eyes that were. <laughs> That was creepy as fuck. What do they say in in Star Wars? Uh, Nub Nub? Uh, or is that Ewoks? I, I don't That know. might be Ewoks. I don't fucking know. Whatini? Something like that. Sure. I'll take it. That sounds right. That, eh. that sounds Star Wars-ian. Well, that's not fair, because I do have an actual Jawa here yeah. doing the voice for me. <laughs> All right. Where are we going? Uh, right here. Back to the cave bleed. Through the light. Yep. Oh, wow, it put you pretty far back. Yes, it did. Unfortunately. I had a chapter mark in my head where I was like, "Where? wait, what happened? The last 20 minutes? <laughs> okay. Let's try this bullshit again. Welcome back. Uh, I think I can get close enough. There nice. we go. Wow, he's Out. tough. Yeah, these level sevens are no joke. I think I know what's going on here. What? I think those darker guys are made of that rock that we have to break. Because they're tough as fuck. Bye. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go ahead and yeah, keep throwing shit. Just keep throwing shit. Yeah, because that one looked normal, and that was pretty easy. But that other guy, before we died, before the break, we he took a sniper shot to the face. And he was Kinda totally did. Fine. Yeah. So I'm You're curious to see where that goes. Also, can I just say the black of like the prisms and the red looks so nice together. It does, doesn't it? Get out of here. Yeah, no, those are definitely tougher boys than your standard soldier. And they Astral don't die the same copy. way, they explode. Or they uh they they um disintegrate instead of yeah. exploding. Hold up, hold up, hold up. His sharpened. There we go. Nope. Okay, so that's the minor dudes down yep. there. However, abdup, abrupt physical relocation could potentially be a variant of the jukebox effect. Momentary time manipulation. Interesting. Brief increase in physical speed, inhibiting the sit witness's sense of sight. So they are kind of blind. The witnesses. We do accept. No, uh, oh, you would be the witness. Me. Yeah. Oh, so that's how they're doing it three ways. Yeah. Uh, his sharpens ability is not connected to a known object of power, then the his are either manifesting unique paranatural abilities or there are objects in the house that we aren't aware of. Either way, the his are continuing to develop new strains of corruption and that's cause for concern. Fuck. For real. Uh, but da, da, da. where's the... I, I think we... Mm, I think we might I, have... Um... Astral copy. That's it. Oh, there you go. Okay. Compiled by Emily Pope. Uh, with the astral plane now physically accessible, literally, a torrent of new information has been collected on the inner entities known as astral copies. The astral copies' bodies are made of the of a dense stone-like material that is both resilient under controlled circumstances and brittle when struck with significant force. 
Whether the astral copies possess individual consciences or are directed by a higher intelligence, such as the board, remains unknown. However, their shared aggression seems to be seems to indicate a unified goal. Director Fadden's encounters with these enti entities when binding objects of power in the astral plane indicate they serve as live targets for potential para-utilitarians to practice on. So a bit oh. equipped with bureau weaponry, though it seems unlikely they were armed by our personnel. It is important to note that they appear immune to hiss corruption. Yeah, because they don't have any glow at all. No, they're just black, like, stone Golem. boys. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Golems, if you will. Yeah, no, I mean, really use my head of research right that's now. pretty fucking close. I mean, she's still writing your love letters, so I think we're okay. Yeah, true. Where did that dossier come from? Marshall? Your butt? <gasps> Marshall! Marshall? Yeah, it looked like either Marshall or a rabbit with a scarf, but... Wait, or both. Yeah. So, yeah, that's a good question of how Emily got this message over here right now. It's not even like we're connected through a headset or anything. No. Again, but, gameplay. um... I'll take it. Sure. You know what? She put it on her crossroads. Oh. This place is huge. Yeah, so is the Met me at the crossroads, crossroads. Can you hear me? Be careful, Tim. Copyright. She was on the hotline, so that person she... couldn't have been Marshall, right? One problem at a time. Yeah, Let's seriously. Going on with that pillar first. Investigate the nail. Nail. I think we'll take care of that in a second. Yeah. Because I want to go and back into the uh, the cave bleed room and see mm -hmm. about that other exit. Okay. So you and I were kind of talking about it during the break while I was getting back to where we were. Because when you die in the game, you die for real. And it puts you way the fuck back there. Um, oh, yeah. Up there. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm not going to be able to get up there yet. <laughs> I think you might pop out where you are, just above you. Somewhere up there, maybe. And then be able to maybe go bump, but a bump, but a bump, something, something like, like that. that. Unless we straight up get like a levitate that sends us up. God, that would be great. That's called flying. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, if it would just give you, you know, maybe limited time, but yeah. full flight. Yeah. That you would know, be pretty great. Levitating, but up. Yes. Levitating in an upwards direction. <laughs> All right. Time for the nail. Or that storage room, because it green light means Yeah, go. I was about to say, I kind of need to use the bathroom first, so let's go check out the bathroom. <laughs> Door number Hello? one? No. Nope, this is not a bathroom. <gasps> What's that say? Send to 325? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Nothing else of real import here. <laughs> Damn, Jesse and her force field. I know, I'm stronger than I fucking Pretty look. Just lifting your arm. Hello. Oh, there's another projector, but I, um, normally Can that would be. Can you turn it on? No. Can you throw it against the wall angrily? Yes. Damn. <laughs> normally that would be playing a Doctor Darling clip, yeah. and it makes me sad. You also busted a hole in the table. True. You have to repair that. Uh huh. But we did manage to find a lower cavern that seems structurally predictable. Hmm. Which is a scientific way of saying its walls won't crush us in our sleep. That's good to know. Yeah. Northmore even made a discovery. A pistol that idiot. Let's see. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch! A new gun? No, he found the gun. Oh! Director Northmore. And this place is where they found and who found the, OG? the gun. Oh my god. I'm still yeah. low-key hoping it's a new gun, but I know it's Yep. They had no idea Seriously. what this place was until Northmore grabbed that gun. Mm -hmm. This building has swallowed a dozen of my men, and now it's handing out presents. I don't like it. Playing some sort of game. If it is, we're most certainly losing. Hell, we don't even know the rules. Interesting. So what? What I'm gathering from that, and this is drawing a whole buttload of conclusions here. Mm -hmm. 
is that maybe the hiss let people in here or not okay. the hiss the the board let people into the astral plane because they found this place to carouse in it first back when the bureau of control was just kind of like a a regular government agency i'm yeah. guessing and then director northmore on the expedition through this place found grip mm -hmm. found the gun and okay, was contacted yes for the first time by the board itself, by the entity that allowed humanity to come visit this place. Wow. And I guess had chosen Northmore, because you know how the gun chooses its master, mm -hmm. chose Northmore as the first di like director director. In like what the one would, with direct contact to the board. Correct. What would eventually become this modern day found, uh, uh, Foundation Bureau board. of Control. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like this is this is nuts. So this and, is literally the foundation of the board itself. Or sorry, yeah. of the of the bureau. Yeah, yes. The foundation is both the place and also the time period we are exploring. Wow. That's awesome. So this pillar is where they found the gun. There was a pedestal in front of the pillar. Mm-hmm. Pillar found at the crossroads is best described as an onyx spike that protrudes from the cave floor like an imposing stalagmite. Despite its aggressive silhouette, the structure has an undeniable allure. Freud would have certainly had something to say about the pillar's overly erect nature, but I'm drawn more to Whitmore's essay on dynamic layers, structures within structures, the fractal mirror in every being. Given its significant location, I believe the pillar is either the very heart or the oldest house, or an intrusion within that heart. Or perhaps like the husk of a seed from which the oldest house sprouted. Trottier wrote that the great architecture mm. isn't built. It grows. But then why does the pillar look so different from the rest of the place, concrete walls, and rocky caverns? It's easier, it's, it's easier to see it as just an anomaly. A buried artifact, a foreign body, a demonic phallus. I wonder if this pillar is any more welcome here so, than we are. So, thing of note. Um, that was under the order of no one, so that's because he's acting on his own. Right. The director, quote unquote, went a little nutso. I'm guessing so. To him, at least. Yeah. Even though we are that. Yeah. Interesting. Ah, was what I could turn that over with the with a nice little gunshot. That would have been nice. I know. For um, real. and also, is this the pillar we're looking at? Because it doesn't look like a spike to me. It's the nail. And yes, this is the pillar, this black onyx stone. So maybe it was longer at some, or maybe it's grown since Good then? Good question. Good question. Good question. Uh, it did say it's injured. Huh. So it might have been taller at some point. I don't know. It said, touch it to enter. Repair the nail link to prevent astral consumption co collision. This is the director's duty plot. Nice. Authorized for a new single tool upgrade. Ooh, Use baby. it to save the foundation, us bureau. I like that they call it the nail because it's like a... Left like self or right weapon. Only with... one is permitted. Which oh my God, one Tim. will you choose? So I can only choose one? I thought I was done with these The tests. nail, the board? A oh nail and a board? Oh my God. Oh, oh my god. My god. Oh Are you kidding god. me right now? Oh. The nail in the board. God damn it. Oh, look look at the guy. Grant. He's fracture. showing you what it does. So the weapon will grant fracture, which will allow us to break the crystals. Oh, oh my god. so that's how we get up there. We make platforms. Tim. Explore I don't know. or destroy. I don't know. I don't, now, based on this, I don't think we're coming back and getting the other one, so. I don't know, Dilly. Ugh. This is a real tough choice. Yeah. Because we've seen a lot of places that could really benefit. From the fracture. Yeah. Hmm. See, I insert the gun to get this ability and then I touch to get this ability. That's so fucking cool. That's so fucking cool. It's very cool. Love this game. 
Okay. I don't know, man. Um, okay, fracture his heads. Hey, Google. Flip a eh. coin. Heads. Fracture okay. it is. All right. We let fate decide. <laughs> Thanks, Google. We are upgrading, adjusting the service weapon, gift. Wow, gift, I like that because this, uh, or the nail gave it to you. The minerals roots barnacles, barnacles, grow across the grow. foundation. Whoa. So we are the first to receive this abilita. Now, do you think if we picked, um, if we picked the other one, do you think the other director had that and that's why these are all here? I doubt it. Yeah? I sincerely doubt it. I don't think these crystal formations were here at that time. And because they're regrowing, I would assume that it wasn't done by choice. Yeah. Oh. That's my guess. That was interesting. And will these regrow? It should. It only, it said some. Well, yeah, remember that this, like, Not material, all. this onyx, whatever it is, is, uh, like, impenetrable, <laughs> right? The four locks, keys, MacGuffins, did you catch that? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, what were you saying? Um, th this material, whatever this black stuff is, is, uh -huh. like, impenetrable, right? Indestructible? Yes, yes. So, not just for gameplay reasons, maybe it can't grow back because of this. True. Okay, so I guess it's not, like, indestructible necessarily because I can shoot holes in it so that's not what they're trying to say oh maybe not but it is maybe... definitely incredibly resilient yes at the very least damn physics <laughs> I know for real fucking I don't think that's how that works <laughs> hey I love that dust don't you just bottom looks so good spitting fat bars there Tim <laughs> I thought you'd like that I wonder if a weapon that either does more damage or has a wider spread would be able to would be more effective. Oh yeah, good point. Like the the grip or the uh, the shotgun. Yeah. What is it? Scatter. Shatter. I think so. I think so. One of those. Splatter. <laughs> There's a lot of words Fat. that rhyme with that. Shatter. Yeah, it is shatter. Charge is the one I was thinking of specifically. You know the oh, rocket I launcher. That. I totally forgot we had that. Lure enemies much, onto crystal walkways and then Ooh. destroy the crystal. It's one way to do it. That is absolutely one okay, way to so do it. Okay, so for gameplay reasons, we still have these like pillars. Like if, yeah. if the game needs us to have them. So we're not blocked out of everything, just most Right. Things. Right. And well, we don't have the ability to manipulate them. Get them. As such. Yeah. So like, we can destroy them, just straight yeah. up. Gold guys can't die. Oh, so that I, is nice. I have to, I have uh, to lure him out here. Yeah. And then destroy the platform. That effect on the, uh, what is this called, charge? Yes. Very nice. Implosions are the coolest shit. I agree. Especially because since it kind of like, breathes in before it breathes out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It 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 definitely has the ability to clear every bit of rubble that's around the explosion. Mm -hmm. So this is the best weapon for crystal clearing. The old suck and blow, if you will. You better believe it, son. <laughs> oh, we're back. Okay. Welcome back. Review. This broken pillar is called the nail. Yes. Or maybe it was something and uh -huh. the astral plane is bleeding into the foundation right. which will destroy the oldest house the bureau and everyone inside yes i need to find four locks or keys or whatever mcguffin stop that from happening but i'm the director yep i've handled worse indeed this is true this should be simple yeah. ish there you go <laughs> you with me i'm with you yeah we're good to go, Jesse. Interesting. That's, all right, all right, all right. I'm digging this DLC so far. Oh yeah. 
I love that even Jesse's like, okay, hold up. Fucking stop. This is confusing. One yeah. second. <laughs> For those just tuning in. We gotta, hold up. I gotta put my fucking head on straight here, because this is Seriously. weird. Just toss okay. those tokens. We don't need them. For real. <laughs> I ain't going back in there anytime soon. Well, actually, maybe um, if you go back now that the new DLC's out, maybe uh, the new mods are a part of the pool. Potentially. So it might be worth it to do it off camera. True. Very, very true. I'll, I'll at least take a look into that. Uh, this must have been the call about... Ooh, no, this is new. This is about rituals. Are you sure? Yeah. Locks slash keys kept slash socket us here. Okay. The locks keep us here. Is that it? That is it. That is okay. it. Okay. Useful. Well, Jesse told us that. Yeah. So now that is a it is a broken pillar. Uh, yes. You were you were right about that. Yay! Now uh, the oldest house. Remind me, where did that come from again? The oldest house is the name of the control building. And it was originally just a regular building, or was it originally some distorted uh, influence from the? the I order? don't remember. That, uh, exactly. That That's the thing I don't remember. Yeah, it might be somewhere in here. Uh, we can probably look that up. But go ahead and read that. You read this. I'll look that up. Okay. Uh, on ley lines and their energies. Uh, for all my research into the oldest house's ley lines. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Yes, you are. Uh, I still don't understand why the, the converge here at the base of this pillar. Or why they converge here. Sorry. They converge here at the base of this pillar. Mm. I suppose it's the simplest reason is that they have to converge somewhere. Occam's razor and all that. But that seems wrong. The esoteric world abhors coincidence. This is true. So what is the true relationship between this pillar and the ley lines? Does it act as a magnet attracting them, polar north? Or is the pillar a product of their focused energies, a sprout nourished by the constant flow of the oldest house's power? See, they're very much connected. Hmm. Perhaps classifying that power would prove some insight. However, we, are cur we cur currently have no means of measuring or quantifying it. Given time, it may be possible to collect and even harness this energy. Is that what the grip is? Quote unquote. Mm, um, on that note, yeah. North, because it looks the same too. Like the way, whenever you use a weapon and it's charging up, it has those uh, little onyx like squares around it. True. Uh, on that note, Northmore is bringing up the much la la lauded mm -hmm. word, uh, Dr. Gustav Wagner from his headquarters in DC to aid my research. I suppose this is his way of saying he doesn't trust me to work on the supervised. Let's just hope Dr. Wagner is as smart as his dearly departed Führer once believed him to be. Hmm. Uh, okay, so apparently the oldest house always existed. Okay, <laughs> hence but the it, name. <laughs> yes, but it wasn't until a an altered world event happened in a New York City subway tunnel uh -huh. where the entrance became observed. And once the entrance was observed, the rest of the house was also observable. Interesting. Does that so, make sense? No. So of gameplay. Not. <laughs> it, it, it was locked behind some some event. Yeah. Uh a trigger. To 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 read exactly what it says here so that I not accused of paraphrasing and getting it wrong. <laughs> On August fourth, nineteen sixty four and a suspected alter world event case in the New York City subway tunnels accidentally found an entrance to the oldest house. Hmm. And I'm guessing that that's a lot of the tunnels that we saw towards the end of the game. The underground stuff? Yes. Interesting. At this point, the featureless blank skyscraper as a whole, due to its nature, became perceptible to the Bureau. Hmm. Investigating the site, the Bureau eventually converted it into its headquarters, but the house, the oldest house itself, has always been. So, on the timeline, the events of this DLC so far are what we're seeing with this nail and all that. This is after the oldest house was discovered, but not enterable. Does that make sense? Uh, I guess we still haven't, we have no concrete evidence on that yet. Good question. Cause it was, so the 64 was the AWE that like allowed people to enter Granted in access. this building. Yes. Yeah. Do we have any dates? 
on any of this research. On the new I stuff, wonder. no. Yeah. Not that I saw. Uh, Astral copy. Nothing. No. Oh, that that's a new one. Yeah. Like that's just now. Yeah, I know. Uh no, no, that was the one that we read about the the rock people. Yeah, I mean, uh, it, that's present day, I should say. Gotcha. I see what you're saying. Yep. Words. Foundation Ooh. accident. Contractor Still issue. Nothing. Yeah, no, this... Uh, we didn't read this one, but this one is new. Uh, uh, from the tent, maybe? I have some bad news. You remember that Robert Ricardo fellow we brought in as a special consultant to map the lower caves? Well, today he found a chamber with weird eyes covering every inch of the walls and a strange black pillar in the center. Here. Those are just lights. We saw that, too. Kind of looks like the one at the crossroads, but smaller, so not here. Oh. Because this is... This is the crossroads. Yeah, we're at the crossroads. 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 All caps. We had a bureau member shadowing him, but whatever happened in there did a number on our guest. The docs are taking a look, but it's pretty clear Mr. Adventure's exploring days are older. Aww. Over, excuse me. I know we are careful to limit this guy's exposure to non-ordinary. Drugging him and carrying him through the upper floor was a real hoot, by the way. But we really need to reevaluate our policies on external contractors. Honestly, we'd be better off forming a special division, trained in repelling and, ori and orienteering, then subjecting more outsiders to the shit that we we deal with. They always end up dead or loony. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds Fair. about right. But again, we don't have a date on this. So I'm guessing no. that this is actually after they found it, but before this place got locked off. Okay. After they found the oldest house, you mean? Right. So maybe Director Northmore was one of the first directors. Hmm. Like, we, well, obviously he was the first, like, capital D director with the yeah. gun. But, like, as far as chronologically speaking, he might have mm -hmm. been one of the earliest, as far as we know. Although, Tim, was... is that new? Is the reset new? Yes, the reset is new. So we could always do that and just kind of min-max here. Yeah, but we're not going to do that, though. I mean, literally, I've got everything already all the way done. I know. What am I going to do? Lose Go points, ahead though. and rush to the shield rush? <laughs> yeah. Nah, I think we're okay. Okay. What would I give up? Seizing uh, larger enemies? No. no. Launch large objects? No. Levitating for so long? No. no. Melee that you never use? Hey. Hey, we found one. We found our option. <laughs> ah. All right. Uh, right. Let's see. So going through here is our next step, huh? Reach research site Gamma and the Canyon Rim. I think this is going to be a bad time, Dylon. Probably. But, ooh, uh, I'm a dumb. So, okay, all right. I got a question for you. Either way, this is going to be the end of the episode. Well, yes. To tease people with what's coming next. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God, there's the cave paintings. Ooh. I had not seen them. That's a bug. If That's... I've ever seen a bug. So, before we end this episode... Uh-huh. That's definitely a bug of some kind. Mm-hmm. With gi six giant legs. And a bunch of people floating. And people. And the board. Oh, my God. What the fuck are we looking at? Please tell me there's a file or something over here. There's a classified, but it's not for us. Ooh. Unreal Engine 1. Yeah, I know, really. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't quite get close enough. Get your pierce out. Damn it, dude. That is so cool. Yeah, seriously. I didn't Did think that come we... from the pillar or the nail? No, that so if you remember, there was a thing that we read that very much detailed Oh, that said it just said that they showed up, right? Yeah. But and it was where unclear Where did that bug come from? When, where and how these got up here? Who put uh -huh. them up here? Because these were older than the length of time or, no, these were newer than the length of time that the researchers had been here. Yes. But they also it depicted events from were. the future and the past, so there's got to be more around somewhere. This is just the first one that we've seen. Yes. And, and I don't think they know if it if it's uh, future or past yet. No, they don't. That was what Dr. Ash was saying, was that yeah. it, some of them depict the future, some of them even depict the present, and some of them seem like they depict the future. 
So interesting. It's hard to tell when, where, and then it was around this time that we got bombarded with cavemen, <laughs> which is everybody's dream. Yeah. So we're trying to remember what happened thirty freaking minutes ago, but in hey, the meantime, we can do that. We'll be back here with the next episode. The question is, are we going to head on forward or do you want to spend the next episode going back and getting all the places that we now can unlock with our uh, Ooh, our gun? We could do that. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. <laughs> all right, folks. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Same Tim time, same Tim channel. As always, we'll see you next time. Jesus Christ, that scared me. <laughs> Bye. Bye.